In this session, we'll be discussing about the details of lichen, the association which has been done by fungus and algae. We've already talked about one of the association where the fungus was making the association with higher plants. It was mycorrhiza. So today we'll be seeing how the fungus is getting associated with algae. Now, when you talk about algae and fungus, they are making the symbiotic relationship. Now, symbiotic, it means sim together and biotic means life. So two lives are living together, performing the functions for each other. They are giving the benefits to each other. Bioant means life. The algae partner, it's called phycobiont. Phycology is the study of algae, hence the partner name is phycobiont. When you talk about fungus, it is called mycobiont. So you have one particular partner, fungus, which is called mycobiont. You have an algae partner, which is called phycobiont. Now, this symbiotic relationship is also called mutualism. Mutualism means they are sitting together and mutually they are doing something. Now, when you talk about phycobiont, it means algae. This is basically the member of chlorophyce. Now, let me tell you that there are basically algae. When you talk about there are green algae, there are what you call red algae, there are brown algae. So green algae belong to chlorophyce and they basically are seen when you talk about the lichen association. So algae are basically the members of chlorophyce or they can be the member of BGA also. BGA I've already told you about cyanobacteria. So always remember phycobiont it means the algae partner can be of chlorophyce or it can be of BGA. BGA it's for cyanobacteria. And when you talk about mycobiont, the fungal partner, the mycobiont can be from ascomycetes or it can be from basidiomycetes. If it is from ascomycetes, the lichen is called ascolichen. If it is the member of basidiomycetes, if the fungus is the member of basidiomycetes, the lichen is called basidiolichen. So depending upon what the fungal partner is present, that name of the lichen will be given accordingly. Now when you find the particular lichen, the habitat can be, they can found on soil, they can found on plants, animals, rocks, buildings or etc. But they cannot grow in air polluted areas, very important thing. Lichens will be found most of the places, but in air polluted areas or SO2 polluted areas, they are not found. So they are good, what you call air pollution indicator or SO2 pollution indicator. Now, what is fungus providing? So, fungus is providing the mechanical protection to the algae partner. The algae partner is going and giving what you call getting inside so that the fungus is giving the shelter to that particular algae partner. Fungus is also giving water and minerals to the algae. The algae will be doing photosynthesis for that. Fungus is absorbing water and minerals from different parts or maybe like from the what you call wherever the soil is and it is giving to the what you call algae partner and algae partner is performing the photosynthesis apart from that the reproduction in lichen is basically because of the fungus so fungus is providing these three important roles it is providing the shelter to the algae after that it is providing the enhanced supply of water and nutrients to the algae and apart from that the reproduction in lichen is mainly because of the presence of fungus when you talk about algae, the algae is doing photosynthesis. So algae is providing the food to the fungus. Now when you look about like fungus is doing so much of the things and just algae is just doing photosynthesis. So this is unbalanced symbiotic or unbalanced partnership where fungus is having the major role. Fungus is dominating the role which is called halotism. So such a symbiotic where you have what you call not the balanced relationship, you have unbalanced relationship, fungal partner is dominating, you call it as halotism. The relationship of lichen is also called master and slave relationship. I'll tell you why. Uh, so next session we'll be discussing about the structure of lichens in details.